I said here, I am a girl on a mission today, okay? I am on my way to Sephora for, I mean, why else would I be going to Sephora right now, okay? I need to get my hands on some of that Fenty Beauty, okay? That's what I need to get my hands on, that Fenty Beauty. Uh, Rihanna definitely came through for all the girls, okay? No matter what color you are, okay? She hit about 40 shades. And I heard that there are supposed to be more shades that she's hitting as well. I need to get my hands on that foundation, the primer, that freaking kilowatt trophy wife highlighter. Okay, listen. Ah! That highlighter, ah. I am about to scream. I hope that they have it there so I can do like a little test, like a little, a little whiff because I need to get my hands on that before it's too late. I, of course, am taking you guys along for the journey to, you know, watch me get matched, see how it shows up on camera in real life. Um, I'm really excited about this, not because it's Rihanna. I mean, Rihanna is a baddie, and I love me some Riri, but not just because her. I feel like she, well, not just because it's her, but I feel like the colors are so deep and intense. Um, you know, the darker you are, the lighter you are, like they have a color for every woman in that collection, which I think is freaking amazing. And a lot of foundations, foundation companies, they don't do that, you know. You kill a while, trophy wife, y'all already know I like to be booming, okay? Highlight, I like my highlight to be booming, okay? So I'm looking forward to this, for real, for real. I love her color range, look at this. I know that I'm somewhere in between these. I'm super, super excited because I finally got my hands on some of that Fenty Beauty. But let me tell you guys what it took for me to get it, okay? Let me let y'all know that, you know, Fenty, I'm really ready to fight you right now, okay, Fenty? Fight me, Fenty, because I had to go a lot. I had to go through a lot to get to you, okay? So let me tell you guys about my experience. So I got off work and I originally ordered the Kilowatt um, Trophy Wife online and it said it was gonna take around three days to ship, which was fine, but then I was like, well, what if Sephora has it? But then, you know, so the devil in my mind is like, well, it did just come out, so it's probably all sold out. So me being me, I decided to call like three different Sephora's like, hey, you know, just call and see if you guys have the, the Kilowatt and Trophy Wife and the foundation. And I wanted the entire package. The foundation, I wanted the matchstick, I wanted the, the Kilowatt Trophy Wife. I wanted the entire package because I'm trying to be Rihanna, basically, okay? <laughs> I'm trying to glow like my girl Ri, okay? That's my goal in life, to glow, to be a golden bronze goddess, okay? I talk about this all the time, okay? That's like one of my only goals in life. <laughs> So I finally called one Sephora and she's like, yeah, we have it all. We actually just, just got it back in stock, but you should probably come now because we can't hold it. And she's like, well, what color are you in the foundation? And I'm like, well, I don't know. I don't know yet. I haven't, I need to be matched again because me being a flight attendant or just, not even just the flight attendant, but you know, my, cha my skin changes with the seasons. So sometimes in the summer, I'm more golden-y, and then as it gets a little cooler, I'm more warm. I don't know what I am right now. I'm just out here living life, okay? So I said, well, you know, I want to say, well, I'm kind of like an NC50 MAC, because at Sephora, I wear a different foundation, obviously, than I do at MAC. I usually wear like the Illuminous NARS Glow, but I couldn't remember what color I was. So I said, okay, I'm gonna just swing by there. In my mind, I know for sure that my Trophy Wife highlighter has not shipped, shipped online yet. So in my mind, I'm like, okay, if they have that, if I can hurry up and get there, grab the Kilowatt in Trophy Wife, then I can cancel my order online. And I basically, I won. I won, I'm like the star player, okay? I won. Um, so I called them, they said they have it all. You know, the darker shades are kind of getting sold out, but I should probably just come down, you know, just to see. So I run down there, it's all the way downtown. I work probably like 35 minutes from my house, and downtown is in the opposite direction of my house, but kind of closer to where I work. So I ended up going downtown. You know, the thing that I love 
about downtown it's just it's so diversely cultured um it's so much to do it's very pretty the weather is amazing downtown just puts you like in an amazing mood because you it's, it's just downtown you can't go wrong with downtown now the thing that i hate is parking okay parking is the only thing that I hate I don't know how people live downtown I don't know how people work downtown I don't even like driving downtown driving downtown literally gives me a panic attack it gives me anxiety driving downtown so I did it tell me why I drove around for about 45 minutes I'm not being funny it literally was about 45 minutes 45 minutes of driving around to the point where I couldn't even think myself outside of a box so I decided that Fenty was worth me double parking, okay? I even tried it. I pulled up to like a tow zone and it was like this much. I have a small car, kind of, you know, kind of small. Uh, it was like this much legal parking and then my entire butt would have been out. So I parked there for like two seconds to kind of like scope out the scene. Kind of see like if somebody was watching me or any police officers or you know what. So forward is literally... This is the curb where I park, that's Sephora. So I'm kind of like, I can kind of run in there and still wash my car, but I'm like, with my luck, I'll walk right out and the cop is like, take it on my window and I would not be a happy camper, okay? So I decided uh, to just go pay for parking. Tell me why parking was $16. I'm not being funny, $16. And apparently that was the special. Yeah, that was the special, the evening special price. Finally found parking that was quote unquote cheap. The special apparently was $16 for the evening special, $16 for an hour. So I can't lie, I'm a little bit, um, hmm. Yeah, $16 for the special for parking. Like what in the world? I can't lie. That kind of irritated me for two seconds, but it's okay. I am about to go get my life with this uh, Fenty Beauty collection. So I'm not even tripping. <laughs> I can't lie though, I I'm, I'm a little hurt, but at $16. But that means that I will be in this Sephora for 58 minutes. Nothing more, nothing less. And apparently the morning special between 5 and 10 a.m. is $16. So of course, it's before 7 a.m., so this is the special. You know, I'm a little nervous to know what it is after seven. What, 45? Is it $45 after seven? Like, what is it? How freaking much, how much more is it? Is 16 not enough? How much more is parking, okay? They had something petty too, like 20 minutes or less, 10. I think I spent like 30 minutes to an hour, so it ended up being 16. All I'm thinking is Fenty, you better be worth it at this point because I'm really ready to fight. I'm ready to fight whoever right now because I'm upset. My top lip is sweating. I'm just, at this point, I'm just over freaking life, okay? I cannot lie. Okay, so I ended up going, just paying my little $16, okay? I was upset because you kind of cutting into my, my eyeshadow money. Or I could have bought a whole other lip gloss for that. But all I'm thinking, like I said, is Fenty. You better be worth it, cause I'm ready to. I'm ready to fight you at this point. So I go into Sephora, and instantly Sephora and makeup period just makes me so freaking happy. I'm walking around and I'm trying on lip glosses. It's gorgeous. Do y'all see this this color, this pigment? I am about to die. So so far I'm gonna get this one and the purple. And then the foundation. I am a 370. Listen, I don't feel like I'm being rushed because if I did double park, realistically, I mean, I was going to have to be looking over my shoulder every other second. You know, looking over. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. So with this, I was able to just kind of browse and look around and try on stuff. And I even got to try on the kilowatt. And let me tell you, this kilowatt trophy wife, listen here. Listen, I need to go on a date like yesterday because this stuff, baby. I'm getting sweaty just thinking about it because y'all gotta see this. I love her color range. Look at this. I know that I'm somewhere in between these. Y'all, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Riri, Riri, you got you one. Even though I wanted to fight you five minutes ago, Riri, I just wanna let you know that you got you one with this, okay? So I'm in there and I'm getting matched up. 
so beautiful. We just got the gloss. This one was $3.90? Yeah. Kind of dark? Yeah. Okay. Too warm. Let's see how this goes. So far, I'm in love with the unicorn highlighter matchstick. Okay, is your eyes quick? Yeah. Okay. Alright, let's go see how this one looks. I like this one. You can't really tell the difference between that and the little other that I have on. Was it 270? 370, okay. Let me get a few and then I'll give this to you. Okay. All right. It's like beyond pigmented. I'm gonna look like a golden bronze goddess. <laughs> I feel me coming live already. Ooh. Oh yeah, let me get that. I'll take that. <laughs> it's beyond pretty. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I'll take that one. Hey, we may, may as well throw someone off the cheek <laughs> so I can match. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, wait, look at that. Look at this. Oh my gosh, I'm about to die. And I don't have too much foundation on because I had just come from work. So she's matching me up a little bit. And I asked for like a napkin with some, you know, makeup remover so I can wipe off my face because I want the full effect. I want to know exactly how it blends. She was telling me that the, um, the foundation, it, it kind of oxidizes. So it's best to get one shade lighter than you are because once it dries, it goes to your natural, to your natural shade, if that makes sense. Like it oxidizes. Um, basically it sets to whatever color you are. I'm not saying go three or four shades lighter, but you know, just a little bit lighter. You don't want to go too dark and then it sets and it's way darker than you, you know? Um, she also said, uh, I told her that I have combination skin and you know, me being a flight attendant, my skin changes like every other week. So she told me that this is amazing. This finish is amazing. She said it does get matte, which I do like more of a matte finish foundation, just because I don't like to look too oily. I'm already, you know, I already like to glow. Sometimes I don't know if I'm looking glowy or if I'm looking oily. I don't like not being able to tell. So she did say that it dries like in a matte finish, but she says if it um if you feel like it's drying too matte, you can always use like a really good moisturizer in the beginning and it won't make it as matte, you know, as matte looking. So I did get that and I'm super excited to show you guys what it is. Look at the pigmentation in this. Do y'all see this? This gold against my skin. It's everything that I could have ever dreamed of. I tried a little bit of it on, 
but I know for sure it's gonna look a thousand times better when I actually put my face on. Cause right now I have on no makeup, basically. But it still looks good, look at that. Let me show y'all the lineup of colors though. This is my color right here, 370 warm. I love how these are magnetic. Matchstick. Oh my god. I know it was white, but Oh my gosh, look at this though. This price isn't like 500 more people. I know. No, this was probably like yesterday. This shit was like. No, seriously. Yeah, and my color wasn't even there. And I'm like, really? Well, luckily, I mean, you got enough places to choose from. Right. <laughs> wow, this is very white. Have you tried? Um, these two. I haven't I haven't tried girl. This is freaking girl. 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 Well, like what? I'm about to I'm about to, I'm about to get pissed off. I'm so upset. This is too no, it's, it's too so amazing. Pretty. I'm it's about to make me mad it's so far. No, I got this uh well, I ordered it online because I was tripping. Like, right in line at the queue. I'm right, like, right. Like, you know, I gotta get it. I got this tree. Oh, I had to get that. Oh, how, how does this look? It looks really good, huh? I haven't tried it yet. But it I mean, looks like it would look nice, though. Well, it's gonna look good on everybody. No, it's like a, nice. it's like an amazing neutral. Oh, ooh, yeah, that, ooh, that looks really good on you. Girl, give me a little bit. Girl. Oh, girl. Ooh, that will look good. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I need to get this one too. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get that too. Oh, I'm sorry. sorry. No, it's okay, girl. Yes. You know what? I'm a little bit upset because I went in there just for. I knew for sure I wanted the foundation, and I knew for sure I wanted the kilowatt um, trophy wipe, right? Tell me why. I went in there, and I got the foundation. Here's my little Sephora bag. It's so funny that you can basically put like $1,000 worth of merchandise into this little baby bag. Whenever I see a girl with this little bag, I want to say, shout out to you, girl. How much did you spend? How much? Because I know for sure it's not just $5 worth of stuff in here, okay? I know for sure she went and spent the check in there, okay? So I went in there just for one or two things, ended up spending $122. Fenty, listen, if you didn't have me glowing from 12 miles away, I would want to fight you. <laughs> so this is my bill. You guys see that? 100, not sure if you can see it, but it says $122. $122. Okay, first of all, taxes here is 25%. No, I lied. Taxes here is 10%. $11 in taxes? Like, what? I don't know if I'm more pissed off that I paid $16 for parking or $11 for taxes. I don't know. But the amazing thing is, I was able to get a few things and I'm super excited. Okay, so, I got the... Fenty Beauty, the Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter, and of course, Trophy Wife. I love it because it's creamy, it's long lasting, and it's endless ways to glow. Listen, baby, listen. When I tell you I'm about to be on somebody's beach, glowed up all on my shoulders, girl, I'm putting it on my elbows, on my kneecaps, girl, I'm putting it in my dang on eyebrow. Listen here, I'm about to be looking like a golden bronze goddess all the way. So let me show y'all how it looks. This is the unboxing. So. I like the packaging. The packaging is like really, really cute. I'm sorry, no one was gonna tell me it was upside down, huh? <laughs> so this is the packaging, it's really cute. 
this is like the little swap the um you know swap on it this is how it looks in the box but let's take it out that's how it looks Ooh, so this is it this is how it comes Fenty Beauty I love how all of her things are kind of like the honeycomb shape trophy wife let's see if it's up there. okay trophy wife let's open it up oh <laughs> oh I'm so excited okay so it comes like in a little compact like this how freaking cute is this right Look at this. I need I need to get closer for this because I want y'all to see this. Baby, do you see this? Oh my gosh. Girl. Okay, so I'm going to swatch it and see how it looks. Glow, girl. Listen, do you guys see this? Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at that. Do you guys see that color? It is like beyond intense, okay? I'm in love. I want to just put a little bit on my cheek just for the heck of it. Oh my gosh, y'all see this? Oh, it's so creamy and so pink, girl. Do you see this? Oh my gosh. Girl, it's so creamy and pigmented. Whoo. You know, yes, I would normally use a brush, but I just could not wait. Girl, wait till I really beat this face down, okay? You aren't going to be able to tell me nothing. You barely could, but girl, look, look at the side profile. Do y'all see this? Do y'all see that glow? Oh, we, re, re, you got you one, girl. Gosh. Oh. And I think I really love this because it's buildable. So you can put as much or as little as you want, depending on what the occasion is. Um, or if it's a nighttime or a daytime look, it kind of just depends on you. So I'm loving, loving this. I guess I should probably match this side too. Oh! <laughs> oh baby do you see this oh my god Ooh. oh my gosh girl wait till i really beat this face down listen wait a second oh we oh yeah this is like everything i could have ever dreamed of actually like it's amazing all i did was put one swash one little swash is that a word <laughs> I just swatch a little bit and like just rub it on my cheek and it's like amazing. Okay, I'm like in love with this. This is amazing. Again, this is how it looks. I even love the packaging. It's, it's white. It's very, very pretty. Oh, I'm not really glowing on this side like I am on the other side. Let me just match it, okay? If I'm going to be glowing like this, I want to go all the way. Okay, so I also got the foundation. I am 370 warm. Um, you know, you have the light, the dark. I am in the warm section in the middle. I thought it looked a little light, but like I said earlier, it oxidizes. This is how the boxing looks. Like I said, I am warm 370. This is how the packaging looks, and it's a really nice size bottle, too. 1.8 ounces. It says shake well, so I obviously want to shake it up good. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Okay, let's see how this looks. I'm really loving the packaging. It looks very white and clean. It just looks very, very fresh. So I'm just gonna just put a pump on my, uh, okay, Ooh. ah, okay. So I put one pump on my arm and this is how it looks. Oh, it's very creamy, oh my gosh. Y'all are about to have me looking like a clown. Okay, uh, let me just use my chin. Okay, so I'm just gonna rub a little bit on my chin just to see how, ooh, yeah, it blends very nice. The formula is so creamy and pretty. It looks like it would be light when I put it on, but yet when I blend it with my hand, which I like, I like blending it with my hand sometimes, it gives me a little bit more of a warm finish. Yeah, it dries quick, but it doesn't dry dry and crusty, if that makes sense, you know? So I'm really loving this. Okay, let me see how it looks. Okay, yeah, this is really my color. Yep, I am 370 warm. Yeah, I cannot wait to really wear this, uh, to really put it on correctly. <laughs> but this is really, really nice. Okay, let me try this side. Yeah, this is my color, 370 warm. Yeah, 
Yep. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. Y'all know I go overboard with everything. Okay. Yep. So I put it at the toward the bottom of my cheek, and yeah, it definitely is my color. It definitely matches really nice. The formula is very, very creamy, but it doesn't feel like tacky. You have some some foundations you put on and it's too watery. Or it's like too, too thick and you feel like, oh yeah, this is definitely going to clog up my pores. This formula is very, very creamy and comfortable. Like I said, it does oxidize. So it looks like it's a little light, but once you rub it in and once it dries, it dries to your color. Because I thought it definitely was too light. But already, if you can see it, it definitely is already drying to my complexion. So yeah, Riri, um, Fenty, I want to fight you earlier, but Riri, I think we can be friends now. I kind of want to hug you, girl. I kind of just want to hug you and glow with you. That's all. <laughs> wow. You see how creamy this just dried? All I did was rub it in. It dried so creamy and pretty. Okay, yes, this is everything. Riri, yeah, you hit, you hit, a, you get, you did one with this, Riri. You looked out for all your girls and all complexions. I'm loving it. Okay, so that was two. We did the foundation and then the kilowatts and the trophy wipe. This is the matte stick that I got and it's so freaking gorgeous. All right, I already look like a clown because y'all know that I've been sampling everything, but I don't care. I'm about to find me a spot to put my unicorn on because, you know, I already feel like I'm a unicorn in life, so I just could not pass this up for the name and plus the color. I've been loving purple um, lately. Ooh, okay, so I'm just going to put like a little bit underneath my kilowatt trophy wife. Ooh, blend that in. Ooh, wee, ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so freaking beautiful. Let's do one more for the road. Ooh, okay. Ooh, so freaking gorgeous, man. Oh yeah, this is gorgeous. I swatched it and it looks like, oh my gosh, like it is amazing. So this is how it looks. And this is the swatch. Amazing. Like, I just want to take it with me everywhere. I want to walk around with it in my purse, okay? Like, I don't even know what to do. It's making me upset. I don't even know what to do. <laughs> okay, but I'm not done yet. So that was three things. We got the Matchstick and Unicorn. We have the Fenty Beauty uh, Kilowatt and Trophy Wife which I have up here and as well as on my arm. And then we have the um, the foundation. Like I said, I am a 37 warm. 37, I like 370 warm, 370 warm, okay? So if you're kind of my color, um, cap kind of like combination skin, uh, this color dries to our perfection color, okay? I also, I saw this gloss on Riri in the poster and it looks amazing on me. I kind of have it on now just a little bit because I want to test it out. This is the gloss bomb, okay? This is how it looks, okay? It is amazing. Let me swatch that too. I think this is an amazing neutral for every color, okay? Look at that. Oh my gosh, look at this. I am about to scream. It's so pretty. Oh, this is so pretty and it smells so dang on good. So yeah, I, just need, I think I need a little bit more now. Mmm. The consistency is not too thick but not watery either. So it's a nice creamy base. Uh, it looks really, really pretty on my complexion. So I'm really, really excited to wear this, okay? So, you know, all together, I guess the $16 was worth it. Nah, I'm just playing. It definitely was worth it. And I love how this is also honeycomb shape too. I'm in love with this entire freaking collection, okay? The entire collection, all of it. Like li literally all of it. Man, I'm so excited to try all of these. <laughs> yeah, I really just want to give you all like an honest, honest swatches, honest um, review kind of unboxing. I really just want to give my honest opinion on these. But once I find out some looks to do for y'all, you all know that I'll be back to show y'all, okay? But I just want to show you all how it looks exactly out of the box, like fresh from the box, directly on the face. Barely any makeup. I just want to show you guys exactly how it looks so you guys can live through this process. Also, living through the process of me spending $122, 
and spending $16 on parking. But it was totally worth it. I am beyond satisfied with these looks. Let me know what kind of looks you guys want to see with these, okay? Because y'all know your girl likes to glow from 12 miles away. So let me know. I'm so excited, girl. Let me show y'all this, this glow one more time. One more time for the road. One more. Oh my gosh. Girl, uh, oh my, look at, oh my gosh. Ooh, look at that. And that lip gloss is amazing. Isn't that lip gloss look like an amazing nude? And then that's the purple unicorn. I hope y'all like this. So let me know, can I talk? Eh. Okay, so let me know what you guys think about these products and let me know what looks you guys wanna see with them, okay? I'm super excited to wear them to work on a date in real life, you know? I don't even know if the world is really ready for me right now. I don't even know, but you know, they gonna have to get ready for your girl. Ooh, let me see how it looks on like, my selfie camera. Oh my gosh, ooh wee. Yeah, so just let me know, let me know, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching. Fenty, I no longer wanna fight you.